this volcano in Iceland has erupted for the first time in 6,000 years. It's been spewing lava for two weeks since March 19th. We collected footage from different angles to walk you through the eruption. This is an effusive eruption, which means the lava flow is pretty steady. You won't see big ash clouds like this volcanic event in 2010, which shut down air travel across Europe. Instead, magma that reaches the surface is flowing out of a fissure. Gases like carbon dioxide and sulfur dioxide escape easily, which prevents a big explosion. Here, lava has formed a spatter cone. They're created when lava blobs are thrown into the air and then fall on top of each other to cool. So our expectations are that uh, with this topographically confined area, uh, it'll begin to fill up a little bit like a bathtub, and it depends on uh, how long the eruption goes on. But there's just one spillway, and that's over there. So if uh, the eruption continues for a longer period of time, uh, we might have quite a show once that uh, bathtub begins to drain into the next area. Scientists knew this eruption was coming a month ago. It didn't really begin with a strong bang, but instead we've had this fantastic earthquake swarm with probably 50,000 earthquakes in a, a month. And so the magma had been gradually rising towards the surface. Scientists who have examined the magma say it comes straight from Earth's mantle, nine miles beneath the surface. Magma from that deep hasn't been seen here for thousands of years. While experts are calling the eruption small, it's still bright enough to be seen from Reykjavik, 25 miles away. And even from space. So far, over 10,000 visitors have come to see the volcano. This is my third time coming to the volcano. <laughs> and yeah, I just can't get enough of it. Authorities have even set up a two-mile hiking trail to control the traffic. And everyone is trying to get the perfect shot. The lava is moving so slowly that it's actually safe for people to get close. Like this group of friends who decided to play a game of volleyball. When the lava first emerges, it's 2,170 degrees Fahrenheit. The surface cools quickly, but it's still enough time to fully cook a sausage or two. Scientists are watching for toxic emissions, but the site is still open for visitors. The eruption could continue for years or even decades. Oh. 